Thomas, welcome to Reading Football Club. Hopefully you're glad to be here at Reading and, and ready to go. Yeah, yeah. I'm uh, really happy to be here. Uh, it's going to be a good experience for me and uh, I hope to help the team to achieve uh, these goals. And what has the last sort of week been like? Because you, you signed the deal, but when you were away with Portugal's under 20, so uh, yeah, you're just arriving now, that's right, isn't it? Yeah, I came last night. Uh, today I went to see the, the stadium. It looks great and I can't wait to, to play there. So this is a different type of challenge for you. Uh, you know, you're here in England now, totally different to being in Portugal. And uh, yeah, what were the sort of motivations for you? What were the things behind your decision to come here to England with Reading? Yeah, I came here to play and uh, to learn and to and to grow as a player and as a person as well. Uh, I, I moved out from Portugal for my uh, from my uh, accommodation, and uh, I'm here. I'm here to learn to to play and to, to show my, my, my football to all Reading supporters. And the culture of the football is, is quite different in England as well. You know, we have so many games, like 46 games in the Championship and all the Cups as well, lots of travelling. And Is it something you're familiar with? Do you watch lots of uh, English football? Do you feel like it will suit you? No, yeah, yeah. I, I watch a lot of uh, English football. I don't uh, play 46 games last season. But uh, I hope uh, I can play 46 games this season. And, and here in England, of course, you know, it's very physically demanding. You know, it's high tempo, uh, lots of games like the, you know, and starting with Middlesbrough, that's the first of seven games in, in three weeks. So it's going to be quite new to you, but hopefully something you're looking forward to. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it and I will take care of myself to be able to for those seven, seven matches. And what type of player are you? We've, we've seen you know, the YouTube compilations, of course, but from how would you describe your, yourself? I'm a very technical player, clever player. Uh, I have uh, some, uh, some issues that is normal. I want to, to improve my physicality and I think I'm in the right place to do it. But I'm a very technical, uh, intelligent, likes to, to play good football. Also a good def defender. I think I, I'm a, a complete uh, player, but I, I want to improve more and I'm in the right place for, for to do it. And, and you've got plenty of time to improve as well. You're still a young guy, 18 years old still. And uh, yeah, it's, so it is a, a brave decision to kind of uh, to leave home and, and, and come here. So uh, yeah, you must be looking forward to the opportunities that, that come with being so far from home. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm really happy to be here. Uh, of course, uh, I will miss my home, I will miss my family, but uh, this is my life and uh, I will give my best to, to be the best player that, then, uh, that I can be. And, and even though you're still young, you know, you've got lots of experiences already, you know, you won the Youth League with Porto, you've playing youth international football, you've even played for the first team at Porto, so actually, even though you're so young, you still have some experience already, right? Yeah, I'm a lucky guy. I, I of course, I, I work for it, and uh, God uh, gave me the opportunity to, to, to do what I, what I, what I love in, a, in the biggest stage. So I, I'm really happy for my journey so far, and I'm looking forward to, to see how it goes from this, this point on. And there's lots of Portuguese speakers in the camp, which might make things a little bit easier. But your English is really good already. So you know, where did you where did you learn your English? Was it school? No, no. We, it was with my godfather watching films when I was younger. What kind of films did you like then? Um, drama, thrillers, that kind of. Um, uh, I don't know. The Código da Vinci, you know? Not sure. Uh, the Infernal. Right, okay. Uh, uh, Angels and Demons. Fantastic. That uh, trilogy, I like those three movies. Got you, fantastic. So yeah, you've learnt in a practical way and that's going to be really important. Though. The manager's talked already this season about communication, how important it is. And uh, yeah, have you had a chance to, to speak with him in fact? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I speak with a manager. Sounds, sounds great and I'm looking forward to work with him. Was he a motivating factor for you to come here as well? Did you? Yeah, yeah, of course. I came, I came also here to because of the coach, 
what uh, he told me, the the ambitions, the way the way the team plays, uh, it all uh, was a factor for me to come here. As a footballer, probably the most important thing, right, to get to the training ground, meet your teammates, and that kind of thing. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm really anxious to to training uh, with the uh, with the guys and uh, and to to help them, and I expect them to help me grow also. You've mentioned the sort of ambitions of the club and helping them achieve it, but what about personal ambitions as well? What kind of things would you like to get from this uh, season with Reading? I want to play the many possible game, the many games as possible, and uh, I wanna, I wanna leave a mark. I wanna, I wanna impress, and I wanna show the way I play and uh, help the team for the the most I can. Fantastic. And lastly, Thomas, the, the, I know the one factor a lot of players when they come to England that's really important to them is the is the crowds. You know the uh, the excitement from the stadiums. Probably the one thing that's a shame is there's no crowds at the moment. We still have games behind closed doors. I'm sure you can't wait for that situation to change and you know fans to come back to the stadiums, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. When, uh, the the supporters in England are really close to the teams. Uh, since uh, I was young. I could see that and I'm uh, looking forward to have supporters on the on the stadium with uh, with us.